What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today I wanted to make a video, a quick unboxing video of some products that I got and well, I ordered um, from Adam's Polishes. Uh, as you know, it was recently Black Friday and they ran a site-wide site sale. Uh, I believe it was 25% off your total order and free shipping. So um, it was a really good deal for their Black Friday deals and whatnot. So I went ahead and picked up a good amount of stuff and I wanted to show you guys um, what I got. So without further ado, let's get started. So first and foremost, a lot of sprayers. You gotta have those. Those are very important. The first thing is Adam's glass cleaner. Um, I've never tried it. I've read a lot of good about it. Um, so I'm trying to, you know, make the switch. I got a little bit of chemical guys, a little bit of atoms, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. I'm trying to not necessarily make the switch, but trying to try out all of Adam's products. So, you know, I've been really happy with the products that I do have of theirs. So I'm very excited about this glass cleaner because the glass cleaner I'm using now is terrible. It leaves streaks. Um, so I'm, I got high hopes for this. The next thing is Adam's new spray wax. Um, again, it's another one of those things. Uh, it's one of their new products. It's Carnuba Infused, as you can see right there. Um, another one of those products hey it was on sale why not try it um i use their detail spray on almost on every vehicle every single time i wash a vehicle so this uh i think you do this like every three washes maybe i have to read i forget but um i'm excited to try that product for sure they say it should uh it'll help you know be the water on your paint when it rains and whatnot and make it easier to wash a vehicle and such so we'll see about that the next product is uh, another one of their limited edition detail sprays. It's their Cars and Coffee. Um, I went ahead and picked that up because they had, I guess, some extra left over. And sorry, excuse my dog. He's being loud with his food bowl. Thinks it's time to eat. But anyways, um, I went ahead and picked this up because you know every holiday or event type thing they release a limited edition detail spray. And I started trying to collect, every time they release a new detail spray, I pick one up. So that's kind of like a collection I have going. So it's just one of those things I had, when they first released it, I didn't get it. And they happened to have some left over. So it was really cheap with the 25% off coupon. So I went ahead and picked that up. Smells like coffee, smells great. Um, let's see, the next thing, Ceramic Boost. Um, another one of those products that haven't tried a lot of these products i got really i haven't tried any of them um hear a lot of good about the ceramic boost um on my truck it is not ceramic coated but i did read and watch a lot of videos that you can use this on non-ceramic coated video or non-ceramic coated vehicles um and it kind of gives it that hydrophobic property to a sense obviously not as good as like a, you know a ceramic coat but it still gives it sort of the same thing but um uh, my wife's forerunner is ceramic coated so i'm excited to try this out on that and see what it does um because as weird as it is to say it's harder to dry off a ceramic coated vehicle than a non-ceramic coated vehicle i don't know why but it's just harder um because the water i guess just beads up but we'll try that on there and see you know how that works uh the next thing adam's h2o garden gloss um i've been looking at picking this up for a while now but they've been talking about you know making a new version of it or whatnot so i kind of waited this is the new version of it they say it's easier to apply or easier to work with so it's another one of those things that you don't use every time but they say you spray it right on a wet vehicle and wipe it off and it like seals your paint. So that'll be something cool to try. Um, 
excited for that. The next thing, another detail spray. It's their newest, uh, sorry, this is not the detail spray. This is the Ultra Foam Shampoo um, Car Wash Soap. This is the gingerbread scent. Um, I haven't used any of Adam's car wash soap before. I've been using the Chemical Guys Honeydew. So I'm excited to try this, see you know what the differences are and whatnot. And it's cool they're cool new uh labels they have for the Black Friday and holidays. Let's see. Alright, here we are. The detail spray. It's their also their new limited edition holiday scent. This one is cinnamon, and let me tell you, it is really strong. Um, if you like cinnamon, definitely get some of this detail spray because it smells really good. It's really strong, so it's another one of those. Add it to my collection. Um, their detail spray. If you never used Adam's detail spray, hands down, it's like the best thing ever. Go get you some. You won't regret it. I mean, it works on anything. Your your paint, your windows glass chrome plastics everything um, makes drying off a vehicle so much easier and it gives it that a little bit of protection on top of it so again if you don't have detail spray or you've never tried it if you don't order anything else definitely get some of the detail spray i can't recommend it enough it's one of those things if you're going to be cleaning cars you need to have the detail spray last but not least is adam's glass sealant um, another one of those things where I guess it, from my understanding, it's like Rain-X on steroids. You seal like your windshield and you pretty much don't have to use your windshield wipers from what I've been told. Um, excited to try that. Um, again, my truck doesn't have ceramic coat, doesn't have any of that sealant, none of that stuff. Um, so I want to put that on my truck and definitely see how that does because I would like for the water to just, you know, roll off the windshield without always having to rely on windshield wipers because as you know, they don't always do the best, especially if they need to be replaced like mine. So, and then the rest of the stuff in this box is two of the microfiber applicator pads. This is for the, uh, the glass sealant. So those go with that, put them right there. This is a borderless gray plush towel. I don't know if you can see that. Towels are always good. You can't have enough. Another borderless gray plush towel. This is just a gray plush towel. So when I got one of those. Um, sorry, two of those. Two gray plush towels. And then these are... Comes in a two pack. This is the uh, Adams glass cleaning towels. I guess it's a different type of towel that is meant to be used with the Adams glass cleaner. Um, I guess it doesn't leave streaks at all. I, somehow it's, it's different textures on both sides. So it's supposed to leave, you know, 100% street free, crystal clear glass. Um, so I don't really have any dedicated glass towels, but now I do with these. So um, hoping that helps because again, like I said earlier, the glass cleaner that I've been using leaves terrible streaks, and especially like when the window fogs up, um, especially at nighttime or first thing in the morning, it is like impossible to see out of with all the streaks. So I'm hoping this eliminates that because that makes it really hard to see. And that's everything out of the box. Um, again, I just want to make a quick video showing all the stuff that I bought you know recently from Adams and I'll definitely make videos on you know using the products and what I think about them uh, very excited to try them out um, if there's any product that you want more information on feel free to drop a comment down below and I'll try and answer it again if you're new to the channel or if you have not done so already make sure you click that subscribe button and then tap the little bell so you get notifications when I post uh, new videos I really appreciate it. Um, thanks for watching this video, guys. Again, it was something short and sweet. I needed to post something I haven't posted in a while. Uh, make sure you check back for my next videos when I use these products and let you know what I think about them. Uh, again, drop a comment down below. Thanks, guys.